You know, I love Joe's idea to give it to charity, but I felt like Kat really needed it and deserved it. I mean, she was working three jobs. She was doing everything to make ends meet. I can freaking respect that. A lot of people are curious about this and no, it was not staged or like coached whatsoever. So everything we were saying was like genuinely how we felt, which honestly made it even more vicious and like worse. When it first came out and I watched it, um, I honestly remember feeling kind of sad for myself. Like I pitied myself and I was like, honey, ugh, God, why are you crying? There's literally no other way that I can put this. And this is not speculation either. It was like mentioned during shooting, but essentially it's because he was a straight white male. Um, so some felt that he had literally virtually no struggles whatsoever. If you had asked me that three years ago, I would have said yes. But three years later, definitely not. I've met so many incredible people because of that video. And I feel like I can be proud of the way I behaved in it. See, it's that kind of mentality though that created that racial tension. We were not thinking about that at all. At least I wasn't. And I'm a person of color, but I was kind of treated like I wasn't at all. I think we all needed it. I mean, some more than others, and I will definitely admit that. I feel that others would have benefited more than me. It just wasn't worth it to me in the end. I did walk out of the shoe um, to go cry in the bathroom. <laughs> Yeesh. It hurt tremendously. Um, I've always had a low self-esteem. I've always been sensitive, and it just felt like people were coming after me when I was already down, so yeah. So there's a video that I appeared in that is now going viral and some of the participants are receiving a lot of negative press and there's a lot of misconceptions so I'm sharing my part in all of this. I'm cringing thinking about it like it was so awkward. At first yeah until some of the participants said that I probably would have won if I had just said me and my daughter were like hungry or unwell and then I was like Oh, so you guys are playing it like that. A lot of the scrutiny that this video is receiving is due in part to like the less than nice tactics that certain people employed to further their position in the game and also like racial tension. There was a lot of that. Trust me. The video itself was enough drama. I don't think we could have handled any more behind the scenes drama. <laughs> the end of the day, we have to live with the consequences of our actions, whether they appear instantly or years down the line. So just make decisions you can live with. A couple of accounts on TikTok made the video viral again, but the reason why I jumped into this shit is because someone came into my DMs real crooked and was saying untrue things. 